Okay, so today is Monday the 5th of August and it's currently 11.59. I turn 16 in less than one minute. That is crazy. I'm like hiking nervous. <laughs> it's gonna happen. Hang on. I have birthday cake. Girl, work with me. Okay. <laughs> I'm officially 16. Oh, okay, cake time. Mm. Okay, so far 16 is treating me well. I'm low-key so happy that 15 is over. The first half, low-key slayed, and then the second half, we won't talk about her. Okay, I'm gonna finish having my birthday cake, enjoy the first like half an hour of being 16, and I'll see you guys tomorrow morning. <laughs> So it is currently 918. I am officially 16 years old. It's like it's so weird because I really don't feel 16. I don't know why. I low-key feel 17, which is really weird. But at the same time, I still feel like a 12 year old. I don't know what's going on. Wait, let me let's just move the camera. <laughs> okay, but this morning my parents came and woke me up at around 7, I believe. And then I opened presents, read my cards. I'll do like a quick little haul of everything that I got after I'm finished getting ready. But yeah, and then I got up, slowly started getting ready. And so far it's just like really been a chill morning. And the whole of today, like I do have a couple of fun things planned, but so far it looks like it's just gonna be like a pretty chill day. It low-key doesn't feel like my birthday, which don't get me wrong i'm being spoiled everyone is like wishing me a happy birthday and it's very nice and everything it's just like i feel like the older you get the more birthdays don't feel like birthdays anymore which is like kind of depressing but i feel very special and i feel very loved and everything but it low-key just doesn't feel like a birthday it just kind of feels like another day you know i don't know it's kind of sad also <laughs> during your birthday it really shows you who your real friends are because real friends don't post pictures of your feet. Let's just say that. Oh my gosh, Ollie, I'm coming from you. Dude literally post the most horrendous pictures of me and then proceeded to post pictures of my feet. Like, <sighs> okay, but yeah, as you can tell, I'm busy getting ready for the day because my mom and I are actually gonna go out. We're gonna go to the mall and then I'm gonna go ice skating. And yeah, then later tonight we have like dinner plans and stuff. But yeah, other than that, it's gonna be a pretty chill day. That's also kind of why I wanted to add this in the Life Lately series and not like a separate vlog. Just because I feel like it's a little bit more laid back compared to last year. Because last year my birthday was on a Sunday, so like I had my little party and everything. So it was just like a little bit more eventful. I'm low-key like so exhausted though. <laughs> but yeah, so I'm just getting ready for ice skating. The session only starts at around 12, I believe. So until we leave, I actually think I'm gonna get a bit of work done. I think they finished all of my editing that I had to do last night and like the video is uploaded and like ready to go and everything. I just need to make the thumbnail. So yeah, I think I might do that before we leave. Oh, and then I also have to set up one of my birthday presents. Oh, and I just wanna say thank you guys all so much for the birthday wishes. Oh my gosh, and I've officially had my camera for a year now. That's crazy. I must say, I'm so, so grateful to have such a nice camera just cause like, I don't know. I feel like I've captured such just amazing memories on it. Like while I was editing my party, I was just so so happy that I got so much nice footage of it Oh my gosh, I've like completely just fallen back in love with makeup Like I've always worn, I wouldn't say like a decent amount of makeup, but I've always kind of worn makeup And it's just like, I feel like the last month or so, I've just realized like how happy it makes me It's just so much fun, I don't know, especially like highlighter and blush Okay, and then to top it all off, I'm going to be using this perfume, guys This was one of my birthday gifts, it's the, which one is it even? It's the Ari perfume by Ariana Grande Mia got this one for her birthday and I was like it smells so good so I also asked for it for my birthday oh there we go so I'm officially ready for the day let me do like a quick OTD okay so my outfit today is like very very basic I want to just go for something like fairly comfortable so it's just this black tank top from Carson on jeans are from H&M then I have my converse then my jewelry is from Lovisa I just need to put on some earrings <laughs> and then I think I'm also just gonna put a jacket over because it's not necessarily like extremely cold it's like wait look at this I don't know if you can see that but it's like sunny and cloudy at the same time so i think i might just throw on a jacket when we leave okay that is the otd i quickly just want to do a little haul of everything that i got okay so first things first oh, 
So this is a salt lamp. You've probably seen this before. I've been wanting one for a while now. So yeah, my mom's gonna help me set that up a little bit later. And then I got my perfume. This is just a box though. And then I'm also really excited about this. I got two books. First, I got Bessing on You by Lim Painter. And then Happy Ever After by Lim Painter. Basically, if you didn't know, Lim Painter is my favorite author. I've only read, I think, like two of her books. And I don't know, I just really love her writing style. And even if you read like the acknowledgements and stuff, I don't know, I just really like her energy. But yeah, and Bessing on You is the last book I need out of all of her young adult books. So yeah, I'm really excited to read this. I just actually need to finish better than the movies. Because <laughs> I've already read it, but I'm busy rereading it. So I need to like finish that ASAP so I can start with this. And then Happily Ever After, I actually haven't heard that much about. And the idea sounds really, really interesting. So I'm really excited to read it. Okay, and then next, I got three little prayer Rochers. I love Ferrero Rochers. <laughs> I love Ferrero Rochers so much. It's so good. And then I have like birthday cards. Okay, I feel like I'm missing something. Oh, I don't know if you can see that, but these socks. But yeah, so thank you so much to my parents and my sister for my presents. I'm just so happy and grateful for all the amazing people I have in my life right now. Okay, but before I get emotional, I think I'm going to set my soul lamp up right now. I think I want to put it somewhere like in my cube shelf, either there or where my tulips are right now. I don't know yet. So yeah, I'm going to do that. Then I need to make the thumbnail for my video. So yeah, I'll see you guys when I go ice skating. Okay, so I'm back home in my bed. I'm so tired. I kind of forget that when I got ice skating, I need to make sure that I got a full eight hours of sleep the night before and that I don't go on an empty stomach because those two things combined really made me tired. I was only there for like an hour, I think, just because I got so tired so quickly. And then afterwards, my mom and I had lunch. And yeah, I'm back in bed with my cute little bum bums. I'm just gonna chill here for a bit. I might also just like take a nap. Oh my gosh, I don't know if I've showed you guys this, but I changed up my room like a little bit and it's nothing like major or anything, but I don't know, I wanna show you guys. So first things first, I finally got a desk chair because I don't know if anyone noticed, but before it was just like a plastic chair. But yeah, so I finally have a comfy desk chair and then above my desk, I got a little chapel room poster. Oh, and then by my floating shelves, I have a spring of carpenter poster. I actually stole that from Ollie. And then I have my new picture frame over here that Ollie gave me for my birthday. And then for my cube shelf, I obviously have my new salt. Oh, I didn't show you guys yet, but I put my new salt lamp in here. It looks so, so cute. I'm really curious to see how it's gonna look at night though. Okay, but yeah, it's not really much, but it's something. So yeah, I'm just gonna chill in bed for a bit, maybe get some work done. But yeah, I think we're going out for dinner around the time that my dad gets back from work, which is like usually at around five. So, so yeah, I'll see you guys a little bit later. So it is currently 5 or 9. I'm kinda running late. I was gonna like change into like a slightly cuter outfit, but since I'm running late, I need to like hurry up. I'm just gonna take this like purple sweater from earlier and then my little black handbag. Okay, but for dinner, we're going to Mediterranean, which is like a seafood place, and I'm gonna get sushi. I'll be surprised at this point. Okay, let's go. <sighs> okay, we are back home. My goodness okay but dinner was really good we didn't have dessert because i'm so full i'm so tired it's been such a long day right now i quickly want to like get up put on my pjs and then i'm gonna facetime my friend we haven't spoken in like a hot minute because i've been so busy with like my party and stuff and we're like long distance so yeah i'm gonna put on my pjs call her and then the plan was to watch barbie with my parents but since we ended up having dinner a bit later than we were planning and it's just already kind of late so we're just gonna watch like an episode of gilmore girls so yeah i'm just gonna have like a fairly chill night <laughs> So it is quite a bit later. I look kind of scary. Let me turn the light on. So it is currently 10 14. And we ended up not actually watching Gilmore Girls just because, I don't know, I just wasn't really in a TV mood. So I just sat in my room, FaceTime a couple of friends. But right now, I'm going to get in my bed, get all cozy, and I'm going to start reading my book. I'm actually so, so excited. Like, I love Lynn Painter so much. But before I start with that, I have this little list that I made a year ago on my 15th birthday of things that I want to accomplish before I turn 16. And I just want to kind of go over them and then write one for my 17th. It's looking depressing looking at this 
this because I did not achieve a lot of these which is understandable like a lot of it was like I wouldn't necessarily say out of my control but one thing was to like hit a thousand subscribers on my vlog channel and like if I stayed as consistent as I was at the time of making this I would have absolutely accomplished that but then at the beginning of the year I started just slowing down a little bit with YouTube so it's understandable that it didn't happen and I don't know it's just there's there's a lot of stuff like that on this list but yeah so I'm just gonna go over this list and then make one for my 17th then I'm gonna get all cozy in my bed read my book and then that will end my 16th birthday that is crazy but yeah thank you guys so much for all the birthday wishes I got so many comments today I'm so so grateful thank you to all my friends and family for sending me birthday messages or calling me and yeah I'll see you guys later this week so today is Friday the 9th of August I haven't vlogged in like a couple of days but we have like kind of a fun weekend plan so I thought we'd bring you guys along so basically we are going away for the weekend with my dad's side of the family we're going to this farm in Tonsildus I think I vlogged it before but yeah we're all going again as a family and I thought I vlogged so yeah it's pretty early in the morning it's currently 7 48 but yeah my dad said he does want to leave at 8 which I don't think is happening and I think the drive is around like 2 3 maybe hours I actually have no clue but yeah i'm lucky looking forward to just sitting in the car and listening to music <laughs> because like obviously i listen to music every day but it's just like nothing hits as hard as a long road trip with like uninterrupted music but yeah so that's the plan for today once we get there it's probably going to be really chill oh my gosh also high key depressing but my tulips are dying i'm so sad it's kind of sad because i like barely even had them for a week okay but i'm just gonna like finish getting ready i just need to do like a little bit of last minute packing thankfully i packed last night but i need to like pack toiletries and charge and stuff like that. Yeah, I'm quickly gonna try and finish getting ready and I'll see you guys in the car. <laughs> So it's 3.16. Oh my gosh, the lighting is bad. We got here at 1. You guys got here half an hour ago. <laughs> Say hello. This is Leah. Hi. <laughs> this is Leah. This is my cousin. We got here a little bit ago. This is our room. All of the chalets. Wait, let me give you a quick tour. If you walk in, it just looks like this. Um, This is okay already a mess. We won't speak of it. This is Leah's bed. This is my bed. Then there's a window. There's also a window over here. Then over here, we just have this little like rack thing. And then this is the bathroom. Okay, see you guys later. Cause baby later we had dinner there was also dessert i didn't have any dinner. the bar to make some bracelets of course what else would we do at this point oh, no. oh, you know what i'm gonna make a one that says sigma for chris that is so weird <laughs> let me move yes. <laughs> your toothbrush sounds weird it's currently 10 28 we had dinner we made bracelets and then we came back to the room kind of got ready for bed i still need to brush my teeth it's so cold oh my gosh and yeah we're about to go to bed we want us to like go outside and like listen to music and live in the stars and stuff but it is so cold it says it's 13 degrees which isn't that cold but it's really cold outside Bro, <laughs> i'm gonna try and get a good night's sleep so i'll see you guys tomorrow morning <laughs> It's currently 8.04. Basically, last night was a rough night. <laughs> I struggle a lot to stay asleep and I woke up at like 5.30 I think because Chris is going on like a thing for school so I wanted to say like goodbye before he leaves but we are ready. We got ready for the day and we're gonna go make breakfast. I think we're in charge of like the bacon. Yeah, we're in charge of the bacon so we're gonna go make breakfast. <laughs> we're gonna go make breakfast. So it's been a hot minute since last time I vlogged. Like we had breakfast, we've just been chilling. But we're playing this game. Okay, I'm goated. Basically, you have like a pack of cards each, and then you need to hold out and try and spot. So that one is the balloon. Yeah, and the first one to see it gets both cards. And then we're playing 
music. So the fire. Gosh, can you even see anything? So it's been a hot minute since last time I vlogged. It's currently 3.45. Basically, like we had breakfast and I don't know, it's just been a really chill day so far. I took a nap because did not get enough sleep last night. Do you have anything to say? Um, sleep <laughs> more. Mm. But yeah, we're on like a little walk right now to wake up because I'm, I'm so tired. So yeah, we're just gonna walk. So yeah. Who's to know what happens when the world ends? At least this is a no okay bye. It's an awful house and I want it to get you Okay, good morning. So today is Sunday the 11th of August and unfortunately today is the day that we have to go home. I'm so sad. It feels like we were ready here. But yeah, we're busy like packing up the room and stuff and getting ready for the day. I still need to go to the front of the house and just have something small to eat. But I think once everyone is ready, um, we're going to start leaving. I think we're going to stop in Dillstrom and have waffles and maybe walk around a bit. I'm not really sure. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 